जी बिस्मिल्लाम डियर फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू इंटरनेशनल अफेयर्स विद डॉक्टर मसूद टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक व्हिच एक्चुअली रियली हॉन्ट्स बी एस एम फिल और पी एच डी स्टूडेंट्स हाउ टू राइट अ गुड रिसर्च प्रपोजल सिनॉपसिस फॉर थीसिस सो दिस इज वन एरिया व्हिच इज निगलेक्टेड एंड आवर स्टूडेंट्स दे mostly when they come to the boards they feel this problem and today i'm going to address this issue okay this this is going to be a series of lectures and today we are going to talk about how to write introduction of a research proposal uh, for bs thesis or uh, ms thesis or phd thesis so let's move forward and try to understand that how you can write a good introduction so first of all um, what is introduction of the thesis introduce the topic and give an overview of the study in this particular section you are going to give an overview of the study try to use less resources and uh, focus on your own analytical skills and try to give uh, an overview of the topic for example if you are working on uh, afghanistan and post 2021 situation in afghanistan and how it impacts the regional security so in this particular area topic you can give an overview that how and why afghanistan is facing this issue today uh, for example uh, afghanistan has been um, uh, you know uh, in the center of gravity uh, it has been facing civil wars it has been facing uh, external aggressions it has been facing different issues regional proxy wars etc so given overview of the topic that afghanistan has been under the uh, threat of these issues and keeping in view these issues afghanistan is suffering today and especially the 911 um, post 911 situation seriously impacted afghanistan security and um, throughout united states of america stay in afghanistan was totally a mess not only for afghanistan but also for the regional security so the post 2000 security situation in afghanistan is going to create serious challenges uh not only for afghanistan but also for the regional security because transnational terrorism would increase their um drug trafficking and other issues uh terrorist organization they are going to get their place here in afghanistan again and that is going to seriously impact on other states so this is how you are going to give an overview of the study in this particular area second important thing in the introduction is discuss why your topic is unique and there must be further research on this topic for example you can say in this particular topic that afghanistan is very important country and it is it is it is located in a, such a situation where um central asia pakistan um, and many other states in the region they are relying on afghanistan like like for example russians are also concerned the chinese are also concerned indians got uh, economic and strategic interest in afghanistan and pakistan also got uh, political economic and strategic interest in afghanistan so this topic is unique because it is going to impact on the regional security and global security because anything happens in afghanistan when it comes to the transnational terrorism so uh, it is unique it is important so uh, what happened in a, uh, you know uh, in the 90s that uh, uh, taliban gave shelter to al qaeda al qaeda established themselves in afghanistan and they carried out 9/11 uh, which was a serious threat uh, for the uh, which was a serious challenge you can say um, for the united states of america security so you need to make it unique so after 2021 situation is also now going to get worse because uh, many terrorist groups in afghanistan they are going to um they are going to get shelter in afghanistan for example al qaeda imu islamic movement for pakistan etim um and iskp and many others uh, so definitely these groups are going to create serious challenge for the uh regional security and global security so this topic is unique and um, it is going to help so this is how you are going to craft your introduction you can also rephrase your research questions and objectives so that how what are the areas you are looking for for example if you are looking for post 2000 security situation how the afghan taliban are going to tackle the um, international uh, regional security for example how they are going to tackle the issue of transnational terrorism are they going to give shelter to al qaeda ttp imu or other terrorist groups or not um what would be the future of afghanistan when it comes to the regional security and uh, international security 
um, how Afghanistan is going to tackle the proxy wars between Afghan India and Pakistan and uh, others. So this is how you're going to discuss your objectives and your questions as well also. Rephrase them and uh, discuss them in your introduction. Third, identify your goal and make hypothesis. Give a hypothesis. For example, hypothesis, what is hypothesis? Hypothesis is just an assumption that uh, certain things are going to happen because of these uh, issues. For example, uh, post-2000 security situation in Afghanistan is going to seriously impact on the regional and global security. So this is going to be your hypothesis in which you are going to analyze, in which you are going to assume that yes, post-2021 situation is going to get worse, not only for Pakistan, but also for Russia, for China, for India, for others as well and for global uh, actors as well, because uh, transnational terrorist groups, if they get shelter in Afghanistan, they can regroup, reorganize, re-energize, and can plan 9-11 uh, type attacks again in future. So this is going to be your hypothesis. So uh, use these three guidelines and craft your introduction. Okay, what should be the length of your introduction? Uh, in BS thesis, um, the maximum size for your BS thesis is uh, around seven to 10,000 words. And for your introduction, I think uh, 1,500 to 2,000 words introduction is more than enough for BS thesis. For MPhil MS thesis, you can uh, increase the length of uh, word limit uh, to 2,500 to 3,000 words max uh, because the word limit uh, for MPhil thesis is around 20,000 words. When, when it comes to PAD thesis, um, it must be a well-written PAD thesis uh, or introduction. For example, four to 5,000 words is, I think, more than enough. And um, the PAD thesis word limit uh, is more than 50,000 words. So this is going to be the limit of your uh, introduction. Introduction must be uh, 15 to 2,000 2, words in BS, around 3,000 words, 2,500 words, be ample and uh, around four to five thousand words PAD. Um, there are some useful uh, tips as well uh, which you can follow uh, when you are working on your introduction. Uh, first of all, define the research problem and let the readers have an idea about your research. So define the problem that how Afghanistan is going to be the center of stage in coming years. Uh, make it interesting and novel idea. Post 2021 situation uh, is is a is a new study because uh, it is going to uh, you know create serious challenges for the for the world. Provide a background and context to the study. Uh, give a background uh, as well and that how before 9/11, uh, what was the situation in Afghanistan? How Soviet invasion of Afghanistan created mess in Afghanistan, and Afghanistan became a volatile country. Give a background context, then 9/11, and then come to post 2021 situation. I'm just giving you a ref for reference. I'm giving you this topic, uh, Afghanistan. Give an overview of your research, as I told you before. Give an overview of your research, just an overview that Afghanistan is a very important country in this area in South Asia which connects Central Asia as well. So basically Afghanistan is a bridge between Central Asia and South Asia. So um, you can uh, give an overview that how this overall area is going to be very important. It is going to be a pivot area in the future. Explain how your work is addition to existing knowledge. You can also come up with the idea that post 2021 situation is seriously impacting the international and regional security. <clears throat> and the emerging situations, um, situation in Afghanistan is new and it is different. Why it is new? Because right uh, after 2021, Afghanistan uh, is uh, totally controlled by Afghan Taliban. Previously, um, you know, certain chunk of um, area, like for example, Northern Alliance, uh, they were controlling Panjshir Valley. Now the whole of Afghanistan is under their control. They are different. They are different. They are in a different approach. They are accepted by China, Russia, even Iran, India, uh, Pakistan, and uh, America as well. Because America left Afghanistan uh, after dealing with, uh, you know, signing signing a deal with the Iran Taliban. So these Taliban are totally different from the previous one. And the, uh, the way they are controlling Afghanistan is a totally different thing. For example, previously India was not there. Now India is back to Afghanistan. So uh, explain how your work is addition to existing knowledge that 
uh, it is going to create or uh, add into the existing knowledge. So this is going to be a novel study. Discuss your research objectives and questions as well as I told you before that you can also rephrase and put your research objectives and questions in your uh, introduction. So um, this is uh, this was all about introduction, how to write a good introduction for BS, AMPL or PhD thesis. And um, inshallah, in the next video, we are going to talk about the statement of the problem and how you can write the statement of the problem, a good statement of the problem, so you can pass your uh, board exams and ultimately you can finish your thesis on time. Stay tuned uh, with the next video. Thank you very much. Allah Hafiz.